in Manila and we are sponsored by Podcore, San Miguel Corporation and Brasca Hotel. And now for our main session, we have what we call the Boys of Summer here and of course the Higher Lady of Cycling. Natawagin ko si Ms. Judith ulit to introduce uh, our final batch of guests. Yes, definitely. This is Summer Spectacle. Sabi nga ng ating uh, uh, sports editor ng Manila Bulletin of course, PSA uh, president natin, Mr. Tito Talaw. Ito yung kinahihiligan ng mga Pinoy. Hindi pa tapos yung summer, may huling hirig pa. And this is the uh, Letour de Filipinas on its 10th year. 10 years of cycling sa pamagitan nga po ng ating karera which will be happening June 14 to 18. May we welcome our chairman, Letour de Filipinas chairman, Ma'am Autonome Lina. Hi Ma'am, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. And of course, we have uh, some representatives from uh, at least uh, three of the five uh, local teams. We have uh, our champion, El Joshua Carino. That is Philippine Navy Standard Insurance, but he will be representing the Philippine national team this time around with coach Reinhard Grandes. And of course, we have also former champion, yes, Mark Toledo, our champion in 2014. Now with Celeste Cycle, his coach, former national team member, champion din ito, Eusebio Quinones. And of course, ito yung mga baguhan, pero mga palaban. In the recent two UCI events here in the Philippines, itong dalawa na ito ang nanalo ng Best Young Rider. Doon sa kaunanahan from Ronda, Pilipinas, noong February, we have Ismael Grospe, of course, representing Go for Gold. And in the just concluded Pro Ride PH, the Best Young Rider was, of course, Daniel Bentani. So, we to our PSA forum. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, for our first question, bato na natin. Uh, Ma'am, uh, for this 10th uh, year celebration, what do we expect from uh, this site, uh, site, uh, summer spectacle this time? Um, well, una muna, uh, thank you sa pag-post sa amin dito. Um, tayo na um, addition natin for the summer, pero bordering yeah. on rainy style. So, parang exciting ngayon eh, all weather. Hindi lang siya tag-init, pero rain. So, but we're looking for a longer race, mas from stage 4, uh, 4 stages, 5 stages po yung nakuha natin sa UCI. So, mas mahaba po yung karera na yun. So, ma'am, uh, ito po, medyo uh, mas, we expect na mas uh, matindi ang labanan ngayon uh, we have the defending champion pero of course we still have yung mga champions dati na uh, willing agawin ang title uh, ano po ang thoughts nyo nito and of course pwedeng sasagutin nito ni uh, ng ating defending champion yung Joshua no? uh, ano ba ang uh, uh, Ano, expectations mo sa mga gusto mo mago sa corona mo this time? Mas matindi ba ngayon? Nasa nila? Uh, yun nga, mas matindi yung pero Pero nagkakanda naman kami na si tinagda naman na ni Coach Yoko isang na rin siya. Training naman po. How about yung training mo? Uh, Gano'n katagal ka nag-train for this? Uh, yung tagtin sa'yo namin medyo okay pa naman kasi kakatapos na po na laro namin last, last week. So, tingin ko andan pa naman po yung condition. Mm -hmm. Sa mga taga-ibang uh, ano ba, taga-ibang uh, bansa, mga foreign riders natin, sino yung nakikita mong matinding kalaban this time? Uh, marami po, marami alas yung foreign rider po. Like, uh, uh, name po siguro na from what country? Yung country's? China, yung Malaysia, yung maganda, uh, malalakas na rin. Si, ano siguro, si Mark? Mark, natikman mo nang maging kampiyon and Tingin mo, kailangan mo lang ulitin yung ginawa mo dati para maging kampiyon ulit. Ano ka tingin mo this time? Um, kung may pagkakataon, uh, bakit hindi? Sana mauli. Pero uh, hanggat ito yung chance ako na maka, makalaro ulit. Dahil na dyan yung mga bago mga bata. Uh, yung pa rin, yung pa rin ang ano ko, ang goal ko. Gusto ko pa rin siyempre. Uh, pag nagkaroon ng pagkakataon, pupos ko na maka-attack. Uh, Tapa na pa rin. Dito sa Tingin mo, 